Hey there, Jason C. from the CW Source. Did you RSVP for this Gossip Girl episode titled 17 Candles? It's birthday time for Blair Waldorf and she wants nothing but the best for her big one seven, including getting her man back. You don't grant birthday wishes, do you? I'm a priest, not a genie. Well, the next time you talk to him, would you ask him to send my boyfriend back to me? Nate isn't too keen on rekindling the relationship with Blair, so Mom steps up the pressure. I'm not asking you to propose, but it's important that Blair knows how much you value her loyalty. Her loyalty or her mother's? Eleanor's lawyers may have called. What difference does it make? One day we'll all be family, and they won't have a choice in these matters. Blair and I broke up last night. Well, then get back together. This leaves the young Archibald in a tricky predicament. Especially when he gets Blair's hopes up. I've got a birthday present for you. I can't wait to open it at my party. I'll see you there. Hi. Uh, Hi, this is Blair Waldorf. I was wondering if any of the pieces that I put on hold were picked up today. The diamond necklace, really. Reconciliation was in the air at the Humphrey residence. Jenny returned home with a surprise guest. Hey, Dad. Hi, honey. How is Hudson? Your mother must have been kind of surprised to see you. Yeah, she was. Despite the lukewarm welcome, Rufus and Allison took steps to mend fences. Nate, on the other hand, stepped away from Blair's sweet 17, and guess who kept him company? Do you want to go take a walk or something? A walk sounds good. News runs fast in New York's upper-class realm. Don't cry, birthday girl. You'll still get that priceless present you were hoping for. It's the Erickson Beeman necklace. No, I couldn't. Yes, you can. Not bad, Chuck. Has the young bass finally developed some class? Well, is there something that you wanted from her? Yes. Uh, maybe not, but who knows? The libidinous Lothario might be legitimately lovestruck for Ms. Waldorf. We'll be checking our inboxes for word from Gossip Girl. Till next time, I'm Jason C.